Hello YouTube, I thought I'd share with you a wee nugget of wisdom, uh, a timing belt uh, change on a Peugeot 2 litre HDI DW10 engine, <clears throat> bought the toolkit, the expensive laser one, uh, and I've had real trouble finding the crankshaft locking location, that's the tool, that's what it looks like. So I'll show you on the vehicle, so with the crankshaft pulley removed, We'll take the engine until you can see the woodruff key is located about 12 o'clock relative to the sump underneath and then you'll find the camshaft locking location which is about 8 p.m on this vehicle a bit tricky to find mirror really helped but you'll know that the camshaft's in the right position once you've got that pin located and then you go on to lock the crankshaft. <coughs> now, this tool here is shaped in such a way that from under the vehicle. So, I'll give you a better shot. There's the oil filter. And up here, this is where the starter motor sits. We've got the clutch slave cylinder and then right up here you've got a small hole which locates the pin into the flywheel to lock the crankshaft now the manual says you don't need to remove the starter motor and i presume that's why this tool is shaped like that but the problem i have is when i try and locate it in the hole this oil return pipe here is in the way and i can't get it lined up properly to go in so i've removed the starter motor which makes it easier turn the tool around which is a an eight millimeter pin by the way and then that sufficiently allows me to get it into location and then with a bit of rotation i can send it Oh, so I really struggled with the manual, with the toolkit and with Haynes auto data to find out actually where that is. And I sure thought I'd share that with you because I couldn't find any information on the blogs. But yeah, remove the starter motor and you'll find the locating pin.